Hey, welcome back. St. Paul here, sitting here with Oliver Lieber, and uh, we're talking through the entire Am Static record today. Uh, Baby Love. Baby Love, Mother's Finest, um, one of the greatest unsung, kind of unknown by the masses, at least. I didn't know who Mother's Finest is. And you played the song yeah. for him, and I'm like, whoa, perfect. Rock, yeah. funk, yeah. ballsy, attitude. Killer. Yeah. Um, yeah, you know, and it's not that people don't know Mother's Finest, because people that are into, you know, funk and R&B and funk rock and stuff like that, you know, you, you got to know who they are. But they're not, they're not uh, household names. And um, this track, you know, has always just killed me. Um, and, uh, you know, it could have been a Rufus. It could have been Rufus. Totally. Yeah, totally. And, uh, and it's just one of those things where, yeah, man, just the idea of getting a chance to, to, to bust this out was too tempting uh, not to do. And I'm glad we did. It was the last thing we cut, right? Yeah, it, I, I think that we were like, we need one more up-tempo, yeah. balls to the wall track. Yeah. And I think you discovered that you were, or Neil might have discovered that. I don't remember who it was. But anyway, um, we cut it. Uh, and Susanna came in and just sang her butt off. Yeah, I don't think people have heard Susanna Melvoin sing that way, you know? I mean, she's Listen. been a lot. I mean, all these yeah. great ad libs, the attitude that she puts on this. Check this out. You yeah. should have heard me do a little guide background vocal on this. It was hilarious. To yeah. <laughs> do a falsetto three part harmony like that, I was like, Please re-sing this for me. And getting Paul to do his Edgar Winter, uh, his Edgar Winter Sizer solo. My kid was here visiting from Minneapolis, and I was, you know, of course, having fun of like. And then what? Then you came in here. Yeah. Because I remember, I think I played the whole you eight bar whole solo. He actually, he actually played a killer solo, and yeah. um, I just had to step on the back end of it because uh, I'm a guitar player, and that's what we do. <laughs> Yeah. You couldn't leave it alone. It was great. It was brilliant. I was going to win an Academy Award yes. for it, but no. Yeah, no, absolutely. Let that happen. Yeah. So, uh, again, this is another song that we kept a little close to the vest because, you know, there's some things that I feel like are, you know, they're great in what they are, and part of the charm of it is the arrangement. And, you know, it, I really felt like, let's just do this justice. Let's play it well. Uh, it's going to come out a little differently just because of how we play. Right. And, you know, but um, I think that to try and reinvent this and make it a halftime shuffle funk or some, you know. It would have been lame. Yeah, you can get too clever, you yeah. know. When you try too hard, I mean, I remember even coming up with a couple of grooves for this thing for a few songs that we didn't end up doing. And it was a completely different feel, and it sounded like we were trying too hard. Yeah, and I think the other thing is, is when a song is a groove song, and that's what its its main thrust is. If you start changing the groove, you really run the risk of missing, you know, the missing by a mile. Whereas if you're picking a song that it, the other elements in the song are the interest level, or uh, you know, more the interest level, then when you play with the groove. You, you, you're not potentially ruining what made that song great. You know what else you did on this? And, and you got to notice before we end up with the fade here, yeah. there's major minor clashing things going on here that was actually on the original yeah. that we brought into this. And I was like, that's wrong. No, it's wrong. We can't do that. Yeah, it's like, no, it funky. that's what makes it funky. <laughs> that's make, the wrongness makes it rightness. Yeah, the clap players playing major on the four change and right the guitar players playing minor. And it's wrong and right no it's absolutely the way to go yeah man and that's baby love baby love let's continue on not with to be confused with the supremes <laughs> that's true which i did when no i was talking that's right yeah